Hello, all you space engineers out there. Commander Kingfish here, and I am back in Space Engineers. And let me kind of just say, uh, it's good to be back into the game. Uh, as you know, I do a lot of traveling, uh, especially during the summer. And I've been away f uh, all summer. I had recorded a lot of videos and had them already uploaded and scheduled, so that's why there was videos being released. And so Alaska was a great trip. It was a nice travel up there and back. And uh, now it's uh, glad to be back home. One of the other things, too, that has precluded me from... I got back at the end of August. And I was not able to get into the game simply because I had moved. And my internet wasn't hooked up. And I just got my internet hooked up last week. Uh, which is very exciting because... It's going to allow me to actually do a little bit longer videos because I've got uh, fiber optics now for my internet. So I've got uh, uh, gigabyte speed upload and download speed, which will make a big difference in uploading my videos to YouTube. So uh, yeah, so I am back and ready to go. And now I am trying to, got to figure out exactly where I am am and what I've got done as you can see I still have the platform to build out here and enclose this uh, the last episode I got the grinder done and that's going to be my uh, uh, ship that I use to go over and start uh, working on uh, uh, salvaging parts from the uh, old mining settlement over there uh, and so uh, I don't know if I'll get to do that today but I've got to finish building out the platform so I can actually get up and into the ship since I do not have uh, uh, a jetpack here on the surface so a lot of things that I still have to get done and we can take a little stroll around here to kind of get caught up and figure out what I have left to do uh, I got to finish building out that platform getting supports in uh, around the edges so I got more supports there to put in and so I've got to build those out and again enclose all of this uh, I've got to at some point uh, eventually want to put in a second refinery here and boy I'm noticing uh, that I'm uh, getting some uh, uh, frame rate uh, problems there, or a little bit of stuttering, so I'll have to kind of investigate that as we go along. But anyway, that's I want to get uh, another, uh, eventually get another refinery put in here, and then uh, we uh, I've gotten already my energy system set up for now, and it should be in pretty good shape. Uh, let's go in here. Uh, I have a to-do list set up on the board. So I need to get a beacon light set up. Uh, that's just to kind of identify uh, the base and uh, flying at night so you can kind of see where everything's at. I got to do door sensors so that they uh, open and close automatically. Uh, I want to put more signage, lights and signage on the deck, or on the dock here. And uh, I've got the shelves, I guess I've got that done. I've got those kind of put in and around the drone hangar here. And uh, I need to set up my nickel drone, uh, which we've got the drone built and I've already if I remember correctly I already made a run out to the nickel mine so it's just a matter of how much nickel I need and whether I automate that like I did with my cobalt drone uh, I got to do the uranium mine I need to get that set up uh, I want to build a control room uh, an assembler building that's what I was talking about over there and I've built the salvage ship. I just got to finish that and I might be able to check that off. So that is where we stand right now. Uh, let me 
come back over here and figure out I think what I want to do is work over here on the dock today and try to get as much of this uh, kind of straightened out uh, get a uh, ramp up to where I can get in and out of the ship and then uh, yeah to kind of take it from there so uh, so yeah, I will uh, get busy starting to build away here and see if we can't get some progress done today and I will catch back up with you after I've got a little bit of this stuff done. Okay, I've been kind of busy working away here. Uh, a couple of things that I've gotten done. I finished out the platform at least coming out. Uh, where the grinder ship is in place. I've also put in a set of stairs to get into the grinder ship, although I just realized that uh, to get into the cabin I don't I didn't necessarily have to do that. Uh, but I can uh, hop over here and walk around and get into the cabin from here. Uh, or, and then I just, oop. Yeah, that's a little bit of a problem. There we go. And then come in. But, without realizing it, I just figured out that I could actually walk under here and get in and out of the cabin if I wanted to. Uh, so that puts me in, and then that puts me back out. So I could do that as well. But at least wise, I've got scaffolding in and a ramp up to kind of add a little more to the, the docking bay. I also got the, let's, we go down below down here. Uh, I've got all of the supports in for the dock and uh, so that those are all in place so we can see that they're all there if we go around over here to the other side uh, that's all in place up here so I think next step is to put safety precautions in and around the deck let's get back up here up above uh, I need to put ladders in. Uh, what I want to do is put a ladder, not a ladder, but a ramp, a uh, set of stairs coming up so you can have access to get up and down on this side and the other side so you're not having to come all the way back around to get up to it from this way. So if we go up over here, and so I need to put railings up uh, need to finish start putting the roof in and get this uh, in over uh, and then uh, again get the railings up and around so that you got safety precautions here so that's what I'm going to start working on next uh, but I did get uh, this in I got the floor all in and I got those supports in so uh, Let me uh, get back to that and then I'll uh, I'll catch back up with you when uh, I have a little bit more done I am uh, steadily making some progress here uh, I've Got this in place and I think I kind of showed you this the last time uh, getting in and out of the grinder ship. I've started getting, uh, uh, well I had that beam already in in place and I have uh, put another beam, got another beam in and across and of course I will be filling this all in so that this will be a roof over the top of this particular section. I also have got my stairs in over here. I still need to uh, get my railing in and around 
and I'm going to put another stairs on the other side. So I've got this stairs in. I also made some adjustments over on this end. So if we hop up here, instead of having that slope going up, I actually put a set of stairs in right here, which makes more sense actually. So we've got the stairs in, and then I uh, put grading in over the top of the conveyor system that's there, so it's not a tripping hazard. And then uh, I filled this wall in right here. Now, I still got to figure out what I'm going to do over here. I think this is going to get built out some more, and probably... Uh, I'm not sure if it'll get built out all the way over to the edge, but uh, yeah, I've got to build build this out. Uh, and then uh, I want to put another set of stairs in over here, uh, coming down this side, so that uh, you can have access up and up and down over here. So just a little bit of an update on where I am at at this at this particular point and let's see if I can't get some more done here before we call it good today uh, I'd like to try to finish getting at least this section of the dock done getting these uh, beams in across getting the roof in and uh, getting the stairs and getting this dock all done uh, today, so uh, let me get back at it, and I will uh, uh, give you an update here in just a little bit. All right, I am making some progress here. Let's uh, take a look at what I've got going. Uh, I've got the rails in. I've got uh, this this uh, stairs on the opposite side. Uh, this is all in. And so we can get up and down off the deck on both sides without any problem. I've got my beams in going across uh, the center here and uh, across the end. And I've started getting the roof put on and so uh, I also want to get lighting in and I got it idea on the lighting. I have a mod that uh, is uh, a uh, half block lighting block. And let's see if I can pull it up here. Let's go light. Uh, uh, where is it? Half block armor. Oh, that's not it. Let's go to my modded blocks. Heavy armor, half block. And where are you? All right, let's go to light. It's a half block. Where are you at? Well, I guess I'll have to find it, but that's what I'm going to use. I've got like a half block and it should should have been loaded. But what I'll do is those half blocks that have lights in them, I think like every, oh, two or three across uh, that I would have maybe a row of lights coming in from up there that should light the place at night. And uh, uh, I might put some light stands up and around if I have to. 
uh, around the edge. So I'm going to try to, well, I'm going to get that uh, half block light in, put in, and I want to get the roof all done today and finish, get the railings up. So I think that'll be a pretty good day once I get that all done. So once I get uh, get that much completed, I'll uh, catch back up with you here in just a little bit. Well, I think this is going to have to wrap it up for today. I've been uh, actually got quite a bit done. Uh, I've got the uh, uh, dock all built out to here. I got stairs in on both sides. I got the railings up and completed. Uh, I got the roof all done and I got a uh, access to the being able to get into the ship, the grinder ship. And then I got my uh, first row of beams in along with the lighting and that's and that is the half block lighting that I was talking about and here it is I got it under my modded it's it's called a half block light panel and uh, I just didn't have it loaded so uh, it uh, actually makes it pretty nice I like that inset uh, with the light like that and so it's not you're not having to build additional light into your half blocks so you really kind of be able to uh, have multi-purpose on that half block instead of just the block itself so I think that looks pretty good uh, next time I uh, oh I also had uh, finished let's turn this light on I had also finished uh, redesigning this area uh, instead of just that ramp going up I've got the stairs in here I had also got the supports all built out on the this upper uh, upper dock, and so yeah, it's coming along. Uh, next time, I'm going to want to finish. I'll finish getting the beams all done, and I may end up just building this all the way out because I know uh, I'm planning on having this roof go all the way out. Uh, and I'm not going to fill anything in on the sides. I'll just have railings here. So this will be more of an open uh, kind of concept, industrial looking uh, uh, plant. And I kind of like that, that design. And I don't know if I'm going to build this out any further. I kind of like this being open here. Uh, and then I think what I'm also going to do is uh, put in a set of stairs up to the roof and have uh, that roof might even become some sort of landing pad of some sort uh, just for small uh, vehicles and stuff like that all right well if you like this video please hit that thumbs up it really helps out the video a lot and please subscribe that really helps the channel and with that commander king Actually, one more thing. Uh, like I said, it's been a while since I've done this. All you space engineers out there, keep building away and don't get shot. And with that, Commander Kingfish is out of here. And I will see you all in the next video.